You know, sometimes we need to stop and think about all the magic that's all around us every day. Oh, I know there's a lot of bad out there, but there's a lot of good too. And I'm not just talking about the things that you can see, but the things that you can feel. Like the smile on a little girl's face when her daddy brings home a brand new puppy. Or the thrill that you get when you experience a brilliant display of the Northern Lights for the very first time. And then there's the magic, the magic of relationships, or lack thereof. We can all remember those who were special to us, the ones that used to make our hearts vibrate. Those are the kinds of relationships I'm talking about. The ones you remember so fondly, they'll live on in your hearts forever. They're like a seed. You plant a seed under concrete, eventually it will sprout up and break right through. Or you can crush the life right out of it just by rubbing your fingers together. But relationships are so delicate. They're as delicate as a piece of thread. And they're often just as easily broken too. I used to demand things like great beauty. You won't let me find out who I really am, I said. You're intellectually dull, and your cooking's mundane, she said. And the last one, which kind of hurts, please don't go. I really need you. And oftentimes, our relationships can end in this same sort of destruction. But we keep hoping. We keep wishing hoping that we might find a way to take back the words that we've already spoken. Wishing we could somehow restore what's already broken. 